She say we have rules in, in jihad, in, uh, in the small jihad. First, we don't attack the one unless you attack us, brother. Really? You, you, you look so cute. Laugh. I will play a little of her video just for a laugh, and we will go to the reader scholars and see what reader scholars say. Right to attack if we are not attacked. Ah. We can fight only enemies. We can fight only the ones who fighted us first. Yeah, Allahu Akbar. Who is going to listen to anyone? Sheikh Pretty Jamila, she explained it all. Well, I don't know what this Sheikh will say. He is a big Sheikh in the, in the official Islamic TV of Kuwait. <laughs> he worked for the government. <laughs> Kuwaiti Islamic scholar Sheikh Muhammad Hamoud Al Najdi. But you know Sheikh Hamoud Al Najdi, he do not know Islam. Juju from Poland, she knew Islam. She knew what jihad, and by the way, she said, we fight only the one who fight us. So now she is part of the jihad too. So look what the Sheikh, this is the real Sheikh, what they say about jihad. بداية الكلام عن هذا الجهاد هناك من أنكر جهاد الطلب وقال إن الجهاد في الإسلام إنما هو لصد العدوان فقط. See, some he is speaking about the منافقين, the liars like this woman who say that jihad in Islam is only to attack those who attack us. This is what she was saying in the video, right? What a scam you are. He is saying this is absolutely false. Listen carefully. ودفع الظلم عن النفس وهذا غير صحيح لأن الله تبارك وتعالى أمر نبيه صلى الله عليه وسلم بقوله وقاتلوهم حتى لا تكون فتنة ويكون الدين كله لله. So he's saying whoever says such a thing he is a liar. This is not true. The Quran says the Prophet says that the Quran says fight them until there is no fitna and enter the religion is all for Allah. So the reason for the war. It's not because they fight us that this this stupid lady she was saying. I feel sorry for you. You are you are disgusting. Uh, I mean, little brain, a brain of a chicken. No wonder your prophet he says naqisatu aqlin wadin. He said that Muslim women they have half a brain. For me, I don't believe women they have that. But obviously, those who convert to Islam they suffer from that. Fight them until there is no fitna. Until all the religion is for Allah. So the purpose of the fight not because they are fighting us. Because simply we want to make the religion only for for Islam. So anyone he is not a Muslim, we will fight him. So this guy he is saying, and this is this is official TV. This is not those jokers on YouTube. And this is a real shake. Look at look at this beard. His beard is not bigger than mine, uh, to be honest with you. I mean, it's uh, he's getting closer to be like the first uh, the, the the first step of my beard. So when those ladies and those who they are especially who they uh, reaction video for the Quran. Like the guy from the where I don't know from where Albania, reaction video for you know reaction all of the reaction and now this woman she want to teach us about jihad and suddenly jihad Islam is a peaceful religion and she said those terrorists they are not Muslims brother they are not Muslims as you see your prophet is the first terrorist <laughs> tell us more Sheikh so when they say jihad is to push aggression read carefully. And they say that they, they are, there can only be jihad in Islam to, uh, to fend off aggression. But this is not true. فقط ودفع الظلم عن النفس وهذا غير صحيح لأن الله And this is not true. Why? Because Allah says fight them until there is no religion other than Islam. تبارك وتعالى أمر نبيه صلى الله عليه وسلم بقوله وقاتلوهم حتى لا تكون فتنة ويكون الدين كله لله هذا دليل على جهاد الطلب ونشر الإسلام والدعوة. so how how we spread Islam by the sword and this is what Muhammad he did so you are a stupid and you are a dummy and people will laugh at you. And by the way he is quoting the Quran so are you going to say now the Quran is a is a is a is a lie if we go to the Quran because they might say now this is a sheik. Yeah, I mean, you know, he is not right. He is not telling the truth. Uh, you know, you know, what the heck? This is he is, this Quran, وقاتلوهم, chapter 2, verse number 193. Fight them until there is no more fitna. Disbelief, worshiping others along with Allah. Do you see what the, what the problem? So fight them 
fight them and there no more fitna what is fitna fitna is between two brackets this is not my translation disbelief worshiping other than allah so when when there is no other belief than islam then don't call anyone that you taking hair from your eyebrows and having 70 60 hijab with different color behind you to show the abdul that you are a decent balbula and now you became a shake shake, shake pretty and now you are the one who will explain to us jihad we go back to the video كذلك قول الله سبحانه وتعالى قاتل الذين لا يؤمنون بالله ولا باليوم الاخر ولا يحرمون ما حرم الله ورسوله ولا يدينون دين الحق من الذين اوتوا الكتاب حتى يعطوا الجزيه عن يد وهم صاغرون So he's now quoting chapter 9 verse number 29 it says kill the Christians kill the Jews the women individuals he said like Christians and Jews no this is not true this is not true oh my the bra is moving let me let me let me fix the bra this is not true you know the Quran does not order to kill the Christian and Jews this is not true huh only we fight those who fight us okay okay hold on where's the mirror <laughs> oh because Islam discriminate everybody not to allow non Muslim to enter the city of Mecca and Medina and all of us we knew that there is big signs in the highway this is how faith is religion is imagine we have a highway it says uh, uh, you know Christians only Muslims are dirty or uh, uh, Hindu are dirty or you know this is how filthy this cult is Muslim only you see it Muslim only in the highway and if you enter the city of Medina and now like supposedly this crown prince is trying to change that but this is Islam this is the true Islam you know Muslims only or there's highway for Muslims and highway for non-Muslims and the one in red because we will go to hell and the one in green because they will go to heaven Muslims <laughs> And this is stupid woman is teaching us about <laughs> how embarrassing <laughs> so fight against those who don't believe in Allah not the one who's fighting you those are the Christians actually the Christian they protected Muhammad Muhammad he went to Ethiopia they gave him refuge the stupid Christian in Ethiopia they gave him refuge <laughs> this was how stupid the Christians they were at that time so fight against those who don't believe in Allah nor the last day nor forbidding what is forbidden by Allah, which means Islam and his messenger. So anyone don't believe in those things, they will kill him. And those who don't acknowledge the religion of truth, Islam, what, what is the problem? Those people don't believe in Allah, Islam, so kill them. You see here the word fight, is not fight by shoes, not fight by his, uh, words, it's fight to kill. Fight, in English, you know, we say the word fight, if you are going to talk about two people, maybe using their hands. In Arabic, qatilu, qatilu coming from the word qatala, which means kill. So fight to kill, not qatilu by lips stick. So fight those who don't believe in Islam, especially if they are Jews and the Christians, or if they want to live, if they want to live, they have to pay you money. And why Muhammad, he come with this solution? Here, after he forbid non-Muslim to go to Mecca, Medina, as we showed you in the sign, uh, he said to them, if you fear from poverty, because now business will die, Allah will reach you. Right away, he said to them, go and attack the Christian and take the money. So that was a solution for a thief. Muhammad is a thief. If you look carefully, actually, it, it looked like he want to spread Islam, right? But the, the, the truth is he won the money of the Christians. If you pay jizya, we will not kill you. We will let you live. But you pay jizya forever. Right? So 